is the 10th annual. Woo! Hey. Tell me a little bit about how it started 10 years ago. Well, 11 years ago, the three of us met at the Sunbeam Gardens and we said, we should have an art show here. We have an idea, something fun. And Steve and Alice are going, oh my God, yes, let's do it. Can you do it? And so it's like, okay. So then after that, the Noise Art Gallery started to get the artists and organized with the help of Steve and Alice. Steve Nozzle, Alice Reed, who thought it'd be a good idea. And we thought, let's do this. This is what we've always wanted to do. It was time for Lincoln to move to the next level. Thank you for coming here and getting all of these people here to do it with you. It's like, my God. Who all was involved? Game Park, 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 City of Parks. City of Parks. City of Parks Department. It, um, well, what we did is once we came up with the idea and talked about it, I think Julie met with Lynn Johnson, who was the director at the time, and proposed the idea to him and to the foundation. And they went along with it. And they're going, yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. Great. It's another, another feather in the hat for Lincoln for exactly. being you know, smart. So we can provide a great backdrop for all this beautiful art. Yeah. You know, bring people out. They want to see the gardens. And it looks yeah. great with all this art and festivities going on. Just... Tell me about that backdrop this year. Alice in Wonderland is the theme, right? How did you come up with the theme and, and how, did, how, do you, how are you fitting it? Well, we've been, Alice and I have been kicking around Alice in Wonderland for years. We just had not been prepared to do it and then it was like so we did ruby slippers last year and we thought okay let's let's see if we can move to which is based on the wizard of oz so we thought okay let's let's do it mm -hmm. we pick a theme to sort of help us center uh, color choices mm -hmm. uh, the designs for instance we have mushrooms in the ledges we have the smoking caterpillar we have the uh, Mad Hatter's tea tables. We have his hat right there. Yeah, that's the Mad Hatter hat yep. with the bananas coming out of it. <laughs> but, uh, you know, so you might have to have a little wine before you see these conceptual designs, but it's, it's uh, you know, what we come up with to make the designs for the gardens. Tea cups at the entrance, you know. Perfect. Uh, Jabberwockies at the corners. Yeah, yeah. Jabberwockies on the corner. Yeah, just tell me uh, what you what do you think about this event, uh, Art in the Garden? You've been here all ten years. Yes, I'm a long-term member of Noise. I've been around since I've been a member of the gallery since '95. Uh, I love what's been happening with this to have an outdoor event. The idea, Julia has loved the Sunken Gardens. She and her mom used to go here. They've got rich purchase as part of the foundation because it's just been a beautiful area. So uh, I want to support the support this event, so I've been able to be part of it all 10 years, yes. Okay. Um, most of the time I don't have a canopy because I'm working on metal. I have, I want the shine to show through. I'm not complaining at all about today because I'm not broiling. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not